Are you looking for a video on how to convert unit of mass or waste? Then this video is right for you. So, without much further ado, let's begin. Hi, my name is Roel G. Carpio, a math teacher and a coach, and I do math tutorial in my YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to present how to convert units of mass or waste. What is the difference between mass and weight? Mass is the measure of the amount of matter in a body. Weight is the measure of the amount of force acting on a mass due to the acceleration due to gravity. When comparing mass and weight on Earth without moving, the values for mass and weight are the same. If you change your location with respect to gravity, mass will remain unchanged but weight will not. For example, your body's mass remains the same whether you are on Earth or on the Moon. But your weight is different on the Moon compared with the Earth. How do we convert one unit of mass or weight to another? In converting one unit of mass or waste to another, we make use of the following conversion factors. Units of mass or weight in English system, we have 1 pound is equal to 16 ounces. 1 ton is equivalent to 2,000 pounds. We have also units of mass or waste in the metric system. 1 kilogram is equivalent to 1,000 grams. 1 gram is equivalent to 100 centigrams. 1 gram is also equivalent to 1,000 milligrams. 1 centigram is equivalent to 10 milligrams. And 1 metric ton is equivalent to 1,000 kilograms. So let us have examples. We have here, example 1, a container van is loaded with 1.8 tons of goods. What is the weight of the goods in pounds? So in here, we are going to convert this 1.8 tons into pounds. We know that for every 1 ton, there are 2,000 pounds. So we are going to multiply this 1.8 tons by the ratio of 2,000 pounds is to 1 ton so that we can cancel out the unit ton. So, what is left is pounds. 1.8 times 2,000 is equivalent to 3,600 pounds. Since 1.8 is understood to have a denominator of 1, so 1 times 1 will give us 1. So 3,600 over 1 is just the same as 3,600. So in other words, 1.8 tons is equivalent to 3,600 pounds. So let us have example number 2. We have here sample number 2. The weight of a newborn infant is 120 ounces. What is the weight of the infant in pounds? So in here, we are going to convert this 120 ounces into pounds. We know that for every pound, there are 16 ounces. So we are going to multiply this 120 ounces to the ratio of 1 pound is to 16 ounces so that the unit ounces can be cancelled out. So we have here 120 times 1 will give us 120 while 120 is understood to have a denominator of 1 so 1 times 16 will give us 16 120 over 16 or 120 divided by 16 will give us 7.5 pounds. So, in other words, 120 ounces is equivalent to 7.5 pounds. 
So let us have sample number 3. We have here number 3. What is the equivalent of 0.056 kilogram in milligram? So we are going to convert this 0.056 kilogram into milligram. First, we are going to convert this kilogram into grams. We know that for every 1 kilogram, there are 1,000 grams. So we can now multiply 0.056 kilogram times the ratio of 1,000 grams is to 1 kilogram so that the unit kilogram can be cancelled out. Since we are going to convert this into milligrams, so we have to multiply again to the ratio of 1,000 milligram is to 1 gram so that we can cancel out the unit gram. So what is left is milligram. So 0 0.056 times 1,000 will give us 56. 56 times 1,000 will give us 56,000 over 0 0.056 is understood to have a denominator of 1. So 1 times 1 times 1 will give us 1. So in other words, 56,000 over 1 is equivalent to 56,000 milligram. So in other words, 0 0.056 kilogram is equivalent to 56,000 milligrams. So let us have sample number 4. What is the equivalent of 2,400 kilograms in metric ton? So in here, we are going to convert this 2,400 kilograms into metric ton. So we know that for every one metric ton, there are 1,000 kilograms. So we are going to multiply this 2,400 kilograms to the ratio of 1 metric ton is to 1,000 kilograms. So that the unit kilogram can be cancelled out. And what is left is metric ton. So, 2,400 times 1 will give us 2,400. And since 2,400 is understood to have a denominator of 1, so 1 times 1,000 will give us 1,000. So, 2,400 divided by 1,000 will give us 2.4 metric ton. So, in other words, 2,400 kilograms is equivalent to 2.4 metric ton. Tons. So there you have it, how to convert units of mass or waste. I hope that you have learned and enjoyed watching this video. See you again in my next video. Thank you.